Hello and welcome, Paul here, and I am playing Floris, a mod for Mountain Blade Warband. Now, what I am doing is escorting my patrols, or not my patrols, my, yeah, my extra patrols to Sargoth to ensure they can hold that castle, at least so they can make it there without dying, at least. So, yeah, Sargoth was sieged, had about 600 troops and wasn't enough. We managed to defend... So, you know, so far so good. Lady Isola owns Sunno, which is fine with me, I don't need it. I was thinking I wanted it originally, but I don't want to deal with multiple castles and having to put troops in there. Plus I intend to marry Lady Isola at some point. So, it, it makes no difference. Anyway, just escorting these guys so they definitely make it. Telrog Castle has been besieged. Do we own Telrog? Yes, we bloody do. Okay, shit. Um, hundred. Yeah, we may lose Telrog Castle, but we'll see. I might be able to defend. We managed to hold Sargoth at least. All right, there we go. Sargoth's got some more troops in there. Good stuff. Good stuff. Uh, let's upgrade everyone that I can. There isn't actually that many people here. So we'll wait inside. Lady Arcella's been taken prisoner, that's not good. We have 300 troops versus their number is 2 to 1, which isn't bad. I'm just hoping my archers can do decent damage before they get up here. It's the only way. The answer is no, they cannot. <laughs> well, we're screwed. Oh yeah, oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Run, run, run. I need to not be hit by arrows right now. Stop hitting me with arrows, please. Yeah, no chance, no chance. Can I leave? I can... Yeah, the enemy was forced to retreat, but bloody hell, that's not good. The only alternative would be to pull everyone back and have them fire arrows from there. So we could wait here. We'll wait and see what happens. This may be a mistake. Oh, the buggered off. Well, I'll be. Let's see where they go to next. Oh, we were laying siege to Veluca. Uh, nothing ever happened with that. That's fine, though. The enemy is just passing to and from. Okay, here we go again. Next time I get a chance to get out, I'm going to go and hunt down one of these parties and see if I can deal with them. We did manage to hold it though, I will say that, we managed to hold it. Okay, we kill one, we kill one, we kill one. Do we pull them back? Do we pull them back? Do we pull them back? Screw it, bollocks, come on, run, 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 run. Get back here, get back here. Let them up, let them up, let them up, come on. Get here quick, get here quick, come on. Faster, 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 come on. Go, go, this may have been a massive mistake. Letting them all flood over like that, yeah. It's looking that way. Alright, come on, archers. Oh, what a mistake that was. What a mistake. Okay, I'll back out of that. Yeah. We forced the enemy to retreat, though. Hey, you know, that's not bad. I'm going to pull back out of this for the moment. They're going to stay here, continue sieging it. Are they chasing me? No, they're not. I've got 61% health. That's not too bad. All I can really do is just stay there and keep hitting them with arrows. And keep forcing them to retreat. But they're going to chip us away. They're going to chip these lot away. It's not good. And there's no clean way for me to fight any of these guys. Unless I go for this. He's too close to his friends. He's too close to his friends. 
Oh god, yeah, he's too close to his friends. I ain't giving you nothing, mate. Go away. Oh, what I want to do is single him off, fight him, wipe him out and move on. I mean, it's not a bad idea if I can stay and hold Tel uh, Telrog. We're going to stay at the wall this time and I'm just going to hit them as they come up. If I can keep forcing them off, maybe this will work. I just tend to take too much damage. That's it, that's it, that's it, kill him. Chop, chop, chop. Hit by all of the projectiles. They backed off again. That's good. I'll wait here for a moment. Problem is, they're doing more damage to me than I am to them. I'm hoping my allies come by soon. I could run over to Sargoth and recruit some folk. Oh, I have a lot less health this time. Right? Right. He owes me a favour, thank god. This is why I've been letting these people go. They want to chase me? Okay, that's fine. Okay, he backed off. This guy's on his own. Yeah. Oh, allies, thank you. Perfect. I lose a bit of relation with him, but the way I see it, I take him out of play by eliminating him. And his allies, you know, will... I mean, he'll soon come back, that's fine, and I can release him if I capture him, but if we can just, you know, do this bit, that, uh, that'll be good. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. As long as I don't kill the main guy and just lose relation for no reason. Bit of a crush here. I wonder how my horse is. Like my other horse that was wounded, I put my inventory. I do wonder. So in all, that was a good decision to stay and try and hold Telrog because my allies were able to, you know, my allies were able to come and help me secure it. I probably could do with putting more troops in there, but that'll come later, I reckon. That'll come later. Good victory for us. Let him go. So that's one less enemy in this area. I could go for this guy. Tempted to. Can get to it. Okay, we got to him. Before he made it back to his allies. I just want to, you know, take some off the field so if I do leave, I've got some time, you know what I mean? I don't have to rush back before the enemy comes for us. Oh, 
Oh, I'll tell you what. Get out of my way. Are they going round? Get there, archers. We should be able to kill them all before they can even cross. Perfect, perfect. You know what, for the odd few that do get by, I'll be sure to greet them. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Ignore me. Well, they still made it across, but it's fine. Perfect, they come this direction this time. Now they're definitely gonna die. <laughs> this guy's like, nope. Oh dear. Oh, this curves all around. Okay. So with this group of Nords eliminated, that should be less people to go to Telrog. I'm going to need to reinforce Telrog at some point. I really don't feel like doing it, but I need to. There's no point in capturing territory if I'm just going to let it go. I mean, Sargoth secured, Sonos secured, so... Although, we've been at war with the Rodox for quite some time now, same with the Kurgit. It might not be a bad idea if I go and take as much Kurgit territory as I can and hope that we make peace with them soon. That's certainly one thing I could do. Ooh, what did I get? Very nice, can't wear it though. Horse. Oh, it did heal up. So if they become lame, leave them in your inventory. Splendid, splendid. Okay, I won't get rid of my horses again. Let me just keep an eye on Telrog. It should no longer be under siege soon, hopefully. I'm curious where these guys are going though. Maybe if they do decide to actually attack somewhere, I can lend a, lend a helping hand. We've got nothing to eat, that's not good. I'll tell you what, we'll back off to Sargoth, I need food. Wondering where I was going. They're coming back, I think. Oh, sweet Jesus. That's a nice head you have on your shoulders. That's a lot of them. That's a lot of them. Bloody sea raiders. Alright, lads. Follow me. All we can really do is just hold this position. Cavalry, you charge and have a blast, because why not? Oh, 
I don't want them wasting time on these horsemen. If I can help it. of them so we need to so my allies are wasting arrows and stupid horsemen it's annoying we need these guys to die Defend my allies. Boss, get out of there. Come on, lads. Knock your bows already. Or we'll knock your arrows, I mean. Brutal, but it's working. Get my shield up, I saw him. I bloody saw him. It's fine. I'll leave it to my archers. I have full confidence that our arrows will strike true. And kill this enemy dead. Horsemen now, that's not good. Horsemen are the worst. They waste so much time and arrows as my troops are trying to attack them. Plus they get here quicker and disrupt my front lines, which isn't good. I may try to back out of this fight. Yeah, let's back out. We lost a few. I can leave. Let's look at this. First of all, we upgrade everyone just in case. Now we head this way. Oh, you know what? That's not a bad way to go. It's not a bad way to go. I need food, but screw it. Better than dying. Telrod Castle is no longer under siege. I may leave this area if I can get out of here alive. Easier said than done now. Nope, they're attacking it again. Okay, uh... Alright, here's what we do. Here's what we do. We're gonna go to Dirim. This may be a mistake. Close. I'll go get to Dirim. about the food is it tavern a 
that's not the tavern. This is the tavern, and we want drop these in here. Hmm. I'm going to take these rank 7s, I'm going to need them. I'm going to recruit some Swadian peasants that are nearby. I think I need to send one of these patrols up to Telrog. Take troops out of the garrison. Whack these guys in. This will drop me under a thousand, which I didn't want to do, but I feel like I've got no choice at this point. What I may do is send them over there, but not actually have them go into the castle. Because what I want them to do is to try and kill some of these sea raiders and build up their numbers. That might be my best way of doing it. I really don't have that many people in here, it's just all archers. That's fine with me though. Alright, that will do. I want to manage this town, recruit some defenders. Oh, I can recruit 140 times, that's fine. Alright, well, that's good. We're going to go with this patrol, see if we can kill some of these sea raiders, get more troops, and then they'll stick them in Telrog. Anyway, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. Join me next time.